Hello, and welcome to a tutorial on the new Goddard Earth Sciences Data and Information Services Center website. The new website was released in early June of 2017. The primary goal of this website redesign is to make finding data sets and information about these data sets intuitive, fast, and efficient. This short tutorial introduces the basic design of the new NASA GIS Disk website and how to use it to find data and information. Here is the new NASA GES Disk homepage. Front and center is a search box that allows searching for data using either keywords or categories. If you scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, this is what you will see. There are links to many different types of information, a featured image, and the recent news articles. Okay, now we'll show how to do basic data set searching with the new GES Disk homepage. The first way to search is using keywords. Enter the keywords in the search box. For example, we use the keywords aerosol and OMI, which stands for the Ozone Measuring Instrument. With the keywords entered, start the search. Here is the result page for aerosol and OMI. In this case, the search looked for any data sets associated with either aerosol or OMI. If each keyword was placed inside quotation marks, the search would have found data sets associated with aerosol and OMI together. There's another way to do that, which we'll show in a minute. In this case, the search found 127 different data sets. Another way to search is by category. Just click on the Browse Data by Category button, and several different types of categories are available. Here is just part of the list of categories for the source classification. Refined data set searching helps narrow down the list of data set choices. Using just the keyword aerosol on the home page provides a list of 82 data sets. The data set search can be refined by selecting specific choices in the Refine by box located to the left of the search results. Here's this example. First, we enter aerosol into the keyword box, and then initiate the data set search. The result is 82 data sets. Now the Refine By menu can be used. So aerosol optical thickness and Aura Omi will be selected and the result is 11 data sets. As you can see, these measurement and source selections refine the search, producing 11 data set options. Keyword searching can also be refined by putting the keywords in quotation marks, as mentioned before, or using a minus sign to exclude particular keywords. All of the search rules are available under the Help icon. Clicking on the Related Documentation button, will provide a list of documents related to the keywords and other refinements used for searching. To communicate with us, click the feedback button and you can send an email message that we can act upon. If you do send us a message, the contact us page available at the bottom of the home page has a list of information that will be useful for us to efficiently address your query. The top right corner of the new home page has several features accessible with the icons. The alert icon provides vital information regarding GES disk operations such as system downtime and maintenance, data set availability, and special announcements. 
We've already described the feedback button, which is used to email our help desk a request for information or assistance. The help icon is for assistance in navigating the home page and utilizing the search capabilities. The Earth Data Login Registration is required to download data from the GES disk. If you have logged in on the Earth Data Login page, you will be able to download files immediately. If you have not logged in, you will be prompted for your login information when you attempt to download data files. The Earth Data Forums have been initiated to allow users to interact with the data user community, GES disk staff members, and subject matter experts on questions relating to the scientific aspects of our data. The Earth Data Forums allow discussion and interaction on scientific topics. Clicking here allows you to view our news articles, which are discussed on the next slide. Our NASA GES DISC YouTube channel has both instructional and informational videos. Follow us on Twitter to get news and information. Clicking the icon will take you to our NASA underscore GES disk Twitter page. There is also a Twitter page for our popular online data analysis tool, Giovanni, NASA underscore Giovanni. Here is an extract from our news archive. The next release of the website will allow enhanced searching for news articles of interest. Thanks for watching this tutorial. As NASA continues to observe the Earth.